DoorDash still has this idiotic system set up to where you have to wait five minutes before you can take a photo. All right, good afternoon, everybody. It is Dashing Ding coming at you with another day of DoorDash, Instacart, and Spark. It is, oh, what is it? It is Wednesday, May 1st. Yeah, Wednesday, May 1st. Happy May Day, everybody. Um, and I just got back from my W-2. I stopped and grabbed a couple of things. We're gonna go into town. It is currently 4.30 in the afternoon. I just turned on the DoorDash app, and we're gonna go ahead and go do some DoorDash tonight. Now, I did not reach my goal of 100 deliveries in the month of April or a 70% AR in the month of April. So I do not have top dasher or dash now features. However, I did schedule. It is very busy, it says, in town right now. So we're gonna go in and see what we can get. All right, guys, I'll let you know when I get the very first order. All right, everyone, we just got into town and we are doing earn by time on DoorDash. When I first turned it on, I was on earn per offer. I did get an offer, it was from Pizza Hut for $2.01. <laughs> I declined it and then I switched it over to earn by time. So I'll be doing earn by time tonight. Um, I didn't make my goals for Top Dasher this month anyway, so I'm not necessarily doing it for any reason other than it absolutely kills me when I see horrible offers. So if I do earn by time, I never know what I'm gonna get. But we're going to the South McDonald's, we'll grab this order and we'll get it delivered. All right guys, we picked up the McDonald's. I apologize for not giving you content of the restaurant, but I forgot my magnet. So we're just gonna have to do it old style today. But we're just taking this down uh, few blocks and we'll get it dropped off. All right, guys, we just got our next couple of offers, actually. Um, I'm picking up a Subway from the Walmart Subway, and then we're gonna run over and pick up a second order or a stacked order from Pizza Hut. It's probably the one that I declined when I was on earn per offer for $2.01, but we'll find out when we get there. Hopefully that one got picked up by now, but. Anyway, we're gonna go in and grab this. Like I said, I forgot my magnet, so I can't bring you guys with, but we'll be back in a minute. All right, guys, we got both orders picked up. We are on our way to the first drop-off, and I will do my best to get a <laughs> window shot for you since I forgot to bring my magnet, but we're on our way now. We'll be there shortly. All right, guys, we got both the Subway and the Pizza Hut dropped off. <laughs> we got no tip on either one of those orders so we got six dollars and 59 cents from DoorDash which believe it or not isn't horrible for what we did because everything was within like three four blocks um, Subway Pizza Hut both of these places were right here close um, I had a little bit of an issue trying to find the last drop for the Pizza Hut just because the apartment number where the building number was not, it didn't say what it was supposed to say, so. But anyway, we just got another one. We're going back to Pizza Hut, and um, we'll see where this one's going. All right, guys, we just dropped off the Pizza Hut order. You probably saw me driving around a little bit. He forgot to put his uh, unit number in there. But 
we that was a good one we got nine dollars and 32 cents total it was a six dollar tip three dollars and 32 cents from doordash and it was only a few blocks now we just got an order we're going to little caesar's pizza so let's go get it all right everybody the next order is in the pizza bag we got another pizza offer it's from little caesar's this time pizza pizza and we're just about to the customer we got about three four blocks to go so we'll be there soon All right, everyone, we got the um, Little Caesars dropped off, and now we just got our, our next offer. It's from the uh, Mexican food truck that we have in town, and they're getting a Bemidji burrito. So we'll be there in a bit. all right guys we got that um, Mexican food truck order uh, dropped off it's it's me something I I can never remember the name of that place but all right good morning guys this is gonna be the part two or extension of what we just did um, it is currently a Friday May 3rd <laughs> and we were live on Wednesday May 1st we only got a few orders um, we, I think we did like 32 bucks or something so I'm in town this morning for a little bit and we're gonna do a little bit of uh, earn by time try and get a little bit more footage so that we can make this a full video but let's go get it we'll do this here extension of the video and We'll see what we get all right everyone <laughs> so far so far this morning it's been uh, a little dead but uh, we did just get our first order uh, the map is gray 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 so we're only at 1250 per active hour but I did just receive an order from McDonald's it is only going like one point one or 1.7 miles something like that I'm, I'm not even sure but anyway we're doing earn by time um, I'm gonna do a few orders and we'll see you know how close we are to 70 my plan is to do just like three or four orders this morning um, and then I'm gonna head to Itasca Park and do a live stream but Let's head on over here to McDonald's and we will pick this up and go get it delivered. Probably in the freezer. 
Thank you. Thank you. Yep, you too. All right, guys, I just got back to the mall parking lot. Our favorite place to park. And we just delivered that last McDonald's order. It was, I think it was $4.69 what we got. There was a $2.50 tip, and then we got, I think it was um, $2.19 from DoorDash. Now, I just got my next, oh, wait, 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 wait. Yeah, I just got my next offer. Again, it's from McDonald's, but this time it's going like six point some miles. Um, so I'll probably get a little bit more off of DoorDash. It says it's going to take me 28 minutes. It's not going to take me 28 minutes. And I don't know. We'll find out if there's a tip or not. Um, we're just pulling into McDonald's again now. <laughs> As you guys can tell, every time I get a McDonald's order, I'm driving directly into the sun. But McDonald's is not busy. They are, however, taking their sweet time because it took a long time for me to get three measly little um, <clears throat> three measly little sausage McMuffins last time. So I'm gonna hang out here for just a minute. I will say that I have arrived, but we'll go in and get it shortly. Thank you. Hey man, <laughs> for Crystal? Crystal? Yeah. yeah. Thank you. Well, thanks for coming out. Yep. All right, guys. So. We, we did the McDonald's drop, the guy came out. Um, that's one of the houses we call a REM house. Um, it's where um, handicapped people live uh, with either physical or mental disabilities. And then they've got somebody that watches over the house. Um, so it was probably one of the people that wanted to order some food. We got $5.50, it was over six miles, so it wasn't a really good order. Uh, there was a $2.50 tip and we got $3 from McDonald's. Um, and now on my way back to town here, we just got our next offer and it is for Country Kitchen. This one is seven miles. So hopefully there's a tip on it and it'll make it worthwhile. But let's head over to Country Kitchen, we'll get this order. Excuse me. Sorry. <laughs> For Michael? Yeah. All right. Thank you, dear. You're welcome. Yep. I do not. All right, guys, we got the Country Kitchen dropped off and 
we got an eleven dollar tip on that order. It was fourteen, I want to say fourteen ninety seven or something like that. So we got like three dollars and ninety seven cents from DoorDash, and we got an eleven dollar tip from the customer. So that was an amazing offer, super sweet on Earn by Time. And now on the way back into town, I just received my next offer. It is Taco John's, and I think it said it's going 5.9 miles, but we are a good three to three and a half miles from Taco John's. So let's go get this one. And um, I mean, what a banger order we just took care of. So sometimes there's a little bit of rainbow at the end of uh, earn by time. <laughs> How's it going guys? Good. How are you? I'm doing wonderful. Perfect. All right, thank you much. You too. Hurry up and wait. Twenty minutes later. Oh, quit barking. Gosh. Two hours later. Come on. Hold on. All right, guys, we got that last one dropped off. We, you know, the customer put down instructions to hand it to me. I rang the bell, I knocked on the door, the dogs barked, 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 barked. Nobody came to the door. I put down that I cannot hand it to the customer. And of course, DoorDash still has this idiotic system set up to where you have to wait five minutes before you can take a photo. It comes up with the three directions. It says, um, call or text the customer so I text the customer and said you put in instructions to hand it to you so since you can't answer the door I left it on the front steps then it also has the take a photo and then instructions and I just left instructions and I left them on the front steps but you have to wait that five minutes before it allows you to take a photo it's so stupid and it is such an exorbitant amount of time it's like DoorDash, let's cut this down to like two minutes or something. Five minutes is not, you know, if they're not there in two minutes, they're not gonna be there in five. It's like, so anyway, we got that done. Um, but I'm gonna call this, I guess, double shift a shift. <laughs> um, I think on Wednesday we did like $32 and I think today now we did like $30 and some change. So the two together, like 60 bucks, I want to say it's in like three and a half hours or something like that. Pretty close. Um, so, but maybe, maybe four, four and a half hours. So not, not very good. Um, but we did have a really nice banger today, like almost $15 for that one uh, country kitchen order that we delivered. So I am now headed to Itasca State Park. It is my day off, but I'm going to go live for just a little while. Uh, take a little footage of the headwaters, uh, maybe try to go around Wilderness Drive and uh, show some people 
some more area of my W2. <clears throat> all right, guys. Um, I hope you all have a wonderful day. I hope that you make lots of money if you're doing gig work. And if you're just here to enjoy the videos, I really do appreciate it. I want to thank you guys for riding along, coming with me. I want to thank you guys for subscribing to the channel. I want to thank you guys for liking, commenting, sharing, and watching the videos. And we'll do this again. Uh, had a wonderful day. So, guys, this is Dashing Dink, and you know how it goes. Until the next dash. Have a great day, everybody.